Hey there, and welcome to the Science of Sailing program at Pierce Park Sailing Center. This video is for level 1 sailors practicing Marlin Spike seamanship skills. Today we'll be learning lines on the boat and important knots for rigging, so let's get to it. The first thing you'll have to know is how we actually tie boats to the dock. We tie the bow line and stern line to the cleats. The bow line is the line attached to the front of the boat, or the bow, and the stern line is the line attached to the stern of the boat, or the back of the boat. We tie the bow line and stern line to the cleats on the dock using a cleat hitch, which can be tricky to learn at first, but you'll get the hang of it. Take your line and wrap it once around the cleat until it overlaps with itself. Then wrap the line across, under, and over, so that the line makes an X. Then twist it towards the line connected to the boat so that it makes a loop. After stepping on the boat with the way we showed you in the safety videos, you might see coils of line. These keep the boat tidy when you're not using the line. To make a coil, take the standing end in your palm. Grab an arm's length of line from the working end and twist it away from you then bring it to the front of your hand near your thumb. Keep doing this until you run out of line. There are a lot of different ways you can end a coil. One way is to wrap the coil downward and then pull the end through the hole you've made on top. Then you can just hang it on a cleat. The eight knot is one of the most important and frequently used knots at Piers Park. To tie an eight knot, Make a loop with one end crossing over the other. Take the end that's on top and wrap it around the back of the loop and bring it back around the front. Then poke it through the loop and pull both ends. Congratulations, you've done an eight knot. We'll revisit this knot in the next lesson, so don't forget it. On the boat, you'll see lines that we call sheets. Sheets pull sails in and out. These two connected to the jib are called jib sheets. So the jib sheets pull the jib left and right. In this part of the boat, you'll find the main sheets. Can you guess what they do? If you guess that they pull the mainsail left and right, you're correct. There's another type of line on a boat called a halyard. Instead of pulling a sail side to side like sheets, halyards pull sails up and down. There's a jib halyard that raises and lowers the jib. You can find one end labeled above the cabin's entrance. The jib halyard travels up through this pole that we call a mast and clips to the top of the jib. There's also a main halyard that pulls the mainsail up and down. One end is right near where we found the jib halyard and the other end clips onto the mainsail. Now you know some basic parts of a boat. Stay tuned in the next video for how to actually rig a boat, and we'll see you next time.